We're a few miles into Rhode Island off I-95. This is the first rest stop when entering Rhode Island from Connecticut on I-95. This is where they're asking all out of state residents to pull into and speak with the National Guard. While it is mandatory to pull into this rest stop, it is not mandatory to answer their questions. However, they are handing everyone this packet of information about COVID-19. They say it's part of their effort to try and stop the spread. So cars are pulling into this rest stop. They're met by the National Guardsmen here in Rhode Island who ask them a few questions. If they say they're feeling sick, that's when the National Guardsmen are asking them to quarantine for 14 days when entering into Rhode Island. Now, originally, the governor of Rhode Island was just having people from New York pull off and answer these questions, but on Sunday night, she expanded that to all out-of-state residents. Governor Ned Lamont addressed this topic last night. Here's what he had to say. Jean has taken a little, she has one highway that goes into her state, you know, that's on I-95. So she has had state uh, police there or guardsmen, you know, looking for folks with out-of-state plates. We can't do that. I've got hundreds of roads and such coming in and out of Connecticut and the rest of the New York metro area. But the sentiment is the same. If you can, stay home. This is just one of multiple checkpoints along the Rhode Island border. State police also out on the highways, ready to stop anyone with an out-of-state license plate who does not pull into this checkpoint. From Rhode Island, Ashley Afonso, Fox 61 News.